Hey, everybody. Um, just a quick update and just like a lot of crap. A small haul update. <sighs> Whatever. Um, resin reveal. Um, you guys, uh, if you could just keep me in your thoughts. A couple of days ago, I woke up with this ex excruciating pain in my back. And um, I wasn't even able to walk. I was in so much pain. It was horrible. It was the worst pain I've ever felt in my life. And uh, I had to go to the emergency room. Um, the doctors tested me for, like, a lot of different stuff. But uh, every nothing came back conclusive about anything. And so they kind of just sign me off as like back spasms but I've had back spasms before it's never been I've never been in that much pain in my entire life and it lasted for hours and hours um I'm on some real good pain meds right now and so it helps though I'm still sore even on the the heavy duty medication and so just keep me in your thoughts and prayers and all that jazz and I really, really, really would appreciate it. I hope that never, ever happens to me again. But, um, yeah, so I've been kind of out, out of the out of the loop for a while. Today I finally just took, like, some medication and just headed out because I needed some fresh air. Plus I'm doing a buddy package, and I really don't want to be one of those people who you can't depend on when it comes to buddy packages and stuff. So I went out to finish getting some things for that. But I wanted to show you a few things I did. They're not really intricate because, like I told you, it's been rough over here. So, But here's one that I did, the Chippendale stickers. And then there's this Blaze color and Purple Recollections. Blaze is the most beautiful color. I'll tell you what, you guys. I don't know. Young Kinsley was the one that I saw it. I saw it on her page for the first time. And um, she was right when she said that the camera does not do that glitter justice. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. And I got so many different colors mixed in with it. And I feel like I'm going to be mixing it with different colors just to test out to see if it, you know, if it looks good with stuff. So I tried purple first. And I love the way it looks with this purple. So... Yeah, just plain black background. Um, a lot of these aren't finished or sand down. I have this one and this one, and they've got the same color back. It's like a, I'm calling it like a peaches and cream kind of color. Ugh, my back is killing me. Sorry, you guys. Um, yeah, so... But I thought these were really cute, and so I still need to glaze it, and I still need to sand it. But I think those turned out pretty decent. Um, let's see. I can't remember if I showed you guys these or not, but I got inspired to do this one because I was thinking, um, <sighs> lemonade, pink lemonade, yellow lemonade, kind of. Deal. So, lemonade stand. So, that's that one. And then I got my, <laughs> my, my, my punk rock <laughs> uh, popsicle, not popsicle, I guess, uh, ice cream cone thing. I like the way it turned out. It's really pretty. You see all that, the like it has like that pearl effect. That's that shadow dye. I think it turned out pretty well. I like even the. I added some different colors to the black background that I put on it, and I love the way it looks. It's almost like galaxy kind of look, you know, like when people do pieces of the backgrounds are all swirled up. I like it really pretty to me on black time. And um excuse me. I did this one and this one. And Staffy and um Donald. Huh? I can't right now. I'm 
I'm taping. Um, let's see. Mickey and Minnie. Pink and yellow. Dilly, now close my door, please. Close mommy's door. I'm trying to close the dog up. My husband is taking some stuff outside, and he doesn't want the dog running out in and out the house. Anyway, come on, Dill. Come up here. Say hi to the people. Say hellos. Hellos, peoples. Hellos, mamas, friends. Yeah. I can't rub you right now, okay? Why don't you lay down? That's good, boys. Mmm. Love you. Anyway. So, um, yeah. Those are those. And, um, these need to be glazed. Those were glazed, but these need to be glazed. Those pet shops. Like buddies. And this is Hello Kitty. Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm yawning. I haven't been sleeping well because of my back pain. But, yeah, those are those. They need to be glazed and sanded and stuff. So, I was a little impatient and I feel like doing that. This one I've already glazed, but um, if you guys could tell me if you know of a good way to keep this overpour apart from happening because this is resin. I glaze with resin now. At least I try to most of the time. And I'm kind of tired of the that that happening. I've actually kind of gotten better with, you know, getting little specks in it. Fur, as you see, this is usually the fur that I get stuck in my stuff because he sheds like a mother. But... Um, yeah, so I have to, this going to take forever for me to file that down, and I'm not looking forward to it. Um, I can't remember if I showed you guys these or not, so, but these are molds. I got molds that I got from um, House in Houston. Her website, I believe, is um, Kauai Cupcake Weebly com, And, um... I'm going to probably take this and I have a a bow mold. I can't find anything right now. I'm not moving out of the spot that I'm in because um, I can barely sit up as it is without moaning. Uh, but I uh, am going to put this in the middle of the bow. And whenever I find that bow or whatever, I'll show you guys in a video maybe because I just today got my clips or whatever that I needed for that. So, yeah. I got those and I got my, my bootylicious lips. <laughs> so, I think that's what it looks like, a booty. A booty. Look at that booty. Oh, my God. Look at her But Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, um, so, yeah, I'm a little cute skull girl. I love it. She's so cute. <sighs> so, those are those. In my diny, I, I have a Tyrannosaurus Rex done like this too, but I think my daughter kind of five finger discounted it because she really likes these dinosaurs. She wore this one today. I just took it off the chain. But it's the rainbow effect. I don't know if you can see that. But I kept it clear and I just did the rainbow effect. And I really like it like this. I was going to like color it in or whatever, but I'm not sure anymore because I like it the way it is. I might not like color in the dots or anything. And do the toes, but I might still do the face, because the detail on the face is kind of lost in the purple there. So I might do the black detail with the eyes and stuff, so you can see it. And I, for the life of me, every time I do this, I cannot remember this woman's name, and I don't know what it is. It's like cat meow or something. <sighs> I feel like such a dork. I can't remember her name. But she did some resin pieces with lace. And it turned out beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And I was just trying it out just to see what it would be like to try and use it. These are just strips of lace. These aren't even like the large pieces when you get the for the fabric. That's what I'm probably going to end up doing. But this is a piece of the white lace. Which I think is gorgeous. Because I'm thinking if you put it 
like a color behind it, that's going to really pop some dark pink. Or That's why I put the lips in there, too, because I wanted to see what it would look like if something was actually behind it. And I think they are gorgeous. These aren't actual pieces that I would, like, try and sell or nothing. But these are testers, and I like how it turned out. I really, really like The only problem is you have to be careful with the lace because it, it like, it tends to float, float up upward so you can't like think just because you put it in there it's gonna the the liquid is gonna weigh it down enough to keep it up it keeps it tries to float up I don't know if I can show you on here that one's not too bad this one's floated up horribly and that is the reason why it's got all these bubbles in the back because I tried to push in and it was too tacky and it left bubbles left horrible bubbles but um yeah, and I think that's all for that. And then I went to Hobby Lobby because I had a coupon and I bought these. And they were just 99 cents. So if anybody wants those and you don't have them near you, I don't mind buying them for you and sending them to, sending them to you. Um, just PM me and let me know, you know, what you want to do. Then I bought some of this. And it's called, I'm trying to remember, um, it's really fine. And I mean like powdery, powdery fine, you guys, not like the normal fine glitter. If I can, let me see, like you can't even tell, but it really is. It's like, it, it looks like powder almost. So I'm looking forward to using that and seeing what it looks like in the resin. Oh, I can't remember. It's very sweet. Sparkles, fine glitter, um, and the color of this, because they had different colors, it's pink diamond dust. They had a blue and everything, and it was a really good, decent price, I think, too, so I'm cheap, so I just get, like, one thing at a time and wait till I'm, like, halfway through, and then I buy another one. And then I got this. It's awesome. It's got little star you see the stars in it there's little stars actually in the glitter I don't know if you can see that but it's in there can't tell from that angle but there are tiny little golden stars in there with that fine glitter and there are tiny little um, silver stars and then some other color glitters in here too what is the name of this Silver star, so okay, there you go. And I'm guessing this one is gold stars. So let's see. Um, yeah, gold stars. There you go. And then I got some of these because they had a sale. They weren't two ninety nine. They were like a dollar or something because they have a forty percent off. And then I had a forty percent off coupon, and I have another forty percent off coupon too. I don't know if I'm gonna go back or not. We'll see. My Hobby Lobby is a little far, and since my back is out and my hubby has to work the next couple of days, I don't think I'll be getting there until the coupon is over. And I got these black ones because I needed this for a project, and I got a few stickers. I didn't get a lot of stickers. I was trying to limit it, but I got these, and I thought those were, I got them really because I love the way these cute little squirrels look. Aren't those adorable? And because I love the mushrooms. <gasps> and House of Ink Houston, I saw the other day, it's like molding some, a mushroom mold. And I've forever been looking for an awesome mushroom mold. I saw it on one person's video because they said somebody had sent them something like that. And I've been, I've been looking for one. So I cannot wait until she does it. I'm excited. So, yeah. Mushrooms. And then I got deer and all kinds of other. There you go. Oh, crap. Is this 14 minutes? Oh, wait a minute, you guys. I'm going to have to stop this video, and I'll, I'll do an another one. It'll have to be number two.